Hi everyone, welcome to the lift tour in Wolverhampton City Centre. Now, as you probably know, we are not covering the Sainsbury's at St Mark's in the Chapel Ash direction, uh, but we are doing the majority of the lifts within Wolverhampton, uh, which is within the city centre and, of course, uh, the nearby retail park. And also, we will be doing the lifts at the rail station. So I hope you enjoy the video as I take you on a tour of the lifts within Wolverhampton City Centre. Let's go. First we are starting at the St John's Retail Park which is right here. And uh, not all the shops have lifts in. So the following shops that don't have lifts is Pets at Home, Home Base, Tappy Carpets and the shop next door to it. But... We did manage to go into the shops that do have lifts. So we're starting first with the lift in next, which is a techno. And apparently next's techno lift, I think, sounds like a Cone Eco disc. And that is very rare for a techno lift because techno lifts are usually slow. Uh, like the Merry Hill one, which is still out of action. And uh, as you know, Next used to have Oakland lifts, uh, but now they have techno lifts. So anyway, let's crack on with the lift in Next. Find the doors. Okay, then this is the lift at Next at the St John Shopping Park in Wolverhampton City Centre, and this is a techno capacity sixteen hundred kilograms, twenty one persons, built twenty eighteen. First floor. Yeah, yeah, first floor. This was PC World when it was on one floor. And now it's next. Here we are on the first floor. Let's go down to the ground. Go back down to the ground. Let's go up and down again. Go up to one. Ground floor. Find the doors. That sounds like the sounds, please. Turn on the chime. Find the doors. And up. Listen to the motor. Hang on. That sounds like a cone. You get this motor. A beat. Not one. First floor. Go back down to the zero Find floor. The doors. Talk, 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 Find talk, talk. The doors. We're going to go back down now. Now listen to the motor. Wow. Here we are, zero. Round floor. Nine and that's floors. it. There is a lift in SES, uh, but however, I couldn't use it because due to the fact you have to ask the uh, SES sales teams if you want to use the lift. But however, I, I just wasn't bothered. Uh, to film this lift so anyway we're now going to the furniture factory outlet which is next door to home base and uh, this was the original next and uh, as you know back in the day when it was next the lift was an Oakland and yes it's still an Oakland talk 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 anyway this is the lift at furniture factory outlet at the St John Shopping Park in Wolverhampton City Centre. And this is an Oakland lift. Capacity 1,000 kilograms, 13 persons. This was where the old next was. Here we are on the first floor. Lift going down. First floor. Back down to ground. Going to go back down, talk, 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 talk. Stentigate voice as well. You can still see the lift is still complete and original. Furniture factory outlet in Wolverhampton City Centre, St John's Shopping Park. Here we are, the ground. Lift and that's going. it. There is a lift in Wren Kitchens, uh, which has the Piccadilly line voice, but unfortunately I couldn't ride the lift uh, because due to the fact that you have to ask permission from the sales teams, uh, just like in SES. So now we're going along to Curry's, where there's a Phoenix platform lift with a Thames Valley voice. Find the doors. 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 Find
Doors closing. Okay then, this is the lift at Curry's at the um, St John Shopping lift Park in Wolverhampton City Centre. And this is a Phoenix capacity, 400 kilograms. Thames Valley Voice. And this is a platform lift and I have had to talk that music out in here. Talk, 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 talk. Now, I do not want to get a copyright on having to talk that music out in here because platform lifts, it's a bit squeaky this lift is. So I'm still having to talk the music, uh, talk, 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 talk. And here we are arriving on the first floor. So here we are on level one. So we're on level one. First floor. Doors opening. And we'll go back down to the ground floor level. Doors closing. So talk, 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 talk. Having to talk the music. I think the buttons are, I think the... Left going down. I think these controls are Leicester, I think. So I'm still talking the music out. So this is a Phoenix platform lift. Uh, unfortunately, I couldn't ride the lift in SES and uh, Ren Kitchens due to obvious reasons. Uh, but however, I managed to film the lift in Next, the original Next, which is fern which is like a furniture uh, shop. Uh, at least I managed to get all three ground lifts on floor. this retail park. Door's and here we are the ground, and that's it. So then, we're now moving into the city centre of Wolverhampton. And we're starting first at the Wolfen Shopping Centre, which is only on one level. And uh, there is a car park above it. And there are lifts that go up to it. So we're starting first with the lift by the former Argos. Uh, which is an Otis lift. And it is very tiny. Most of the lifts uh, in the first part of the centre are so tiny. Made by Otis. Two. Okay, this is the lift near the Snow Hill entrance at the Wolfen Shopping Centre in Wolverhampton City Centre. And this is an Otis, and this one's capacity 630 kilograms, eight persons. As you can tell, my torch is on. It's Otis. This floor two, go to ground. G, go back down to ground. Open. Ground floor. Going this is the rooftop car park. As we can, as we are on. Doors closing. Going down. Going down. Very nice. Mm -hmm. Bit, bit squeaky. This lift is. Shout out to Black Country Traveller who enjoys my videos. Um. A bit bumpy this one is as ground well. Floor. We are back on the ground. Safely on the ground. Door and that's it. Open. Now we're going to the lift uh, in the corner uh, towards where Primark is. Which is also an Otis but it has been modernised a bit. Okay then, uh, this is the lift near Primark at the Wolfen Shopping Centre in Wolverhampton City Centre. And this is an Otis but this one had been modernised. By concept, got a two. Please mind the doors. Doors Capacity, closing. eight persons, 630 kilograms. Going up. This one's been modernised by concept, but the voice still remains original. Just they've modernised the control panel. Small. And slows. It's a bit Second. Floor. Second floor. It's a bit of a mixed voice. This one is. Doors open. Going down. Please mind the doors. Doors closing. Close. Going down. Yeah. This was Otis and then got modernised by concept. Just, just only modernised the control panel. Uh, to do her fixtures, generic. Ground floor. Ground floor. Doors. And that's it. Now to the lift in Primark, 
which is the main anchor store in the Wolfen Shopping Centre. And the lift here is a Gen 2 with Dewhurst button. Minus one. Okay then, this is the lift at Primark at the Wolfen Shopping Centre in Wolverhampton City Centre. And this is an Audi's Gen 2, capacity 1275 kilograms, 16 persons, built 2006 or modernised 2006, because this was where Little Woods was. We got first basement, let's go to one. Let's go up to one. Let's go up to one. Close the doors, and there's a CCTV camera, and there's me. Hello. Going up. Woo! Here we are, the top floor. Floor one. Floor one. Let's go back down to ground. There's actually goods lifts next to this lift on the first floor, but they're only for staff only. Going back down. And back at ground. Ground floor. Wait for the doors to open. And that's it. The Poundland here used to be a TK Max and a CNA. And when it was TK Max and CNA, there was a lift, which I believe was a Foster and Cross or Titan range, but when Poundland took over, uh, the upper level is now the stock room, so the lift is no longer publicly accessible. And now along to a set of two small Otis lifts, which also go to the car park, and these lifts are near Specsavers and the CEX, and also the popular Black Country uh, Cheapo Furniture Shop, which was there, previously a Peacock's, and it was called How Much. Okay then, uh, these are the lifts near CX and Specsavers at the uh, Wolfen Shopping Centre in Wolverhampton City Centre. Thank you. Let's go to level two. Please mind the doors. Doors. And uh, these are Otis's capacity, 525 Going kilograms, up. seven persons. This is very tiny. There's a lot, there's four of these in this centre. There's four of these, uh, which are Otis this size. Four, two, go back down to the ground. A bit of drilling going on. That's the car preference, that's the car preference key, that's the alarm bell. There's no door closed button, so there's only a door hold button in this lift, in these lifts, and probably the rest of the lifts in the shopping centre. Ground floor. Ground floor level. And that's it. And now to the lift near Iceland which was okay, an Otis uh, and got modernised by Concept. Iceland at the uh, Wolfram Shopping Centre in Wolverhampton City Centre. And uh, this is a Concept. And this used to be Otis, then it got modernised by Concept. And it used to have windows, but there isn't any more. Dewhurst fixture. Oh, here it is. It's coming. So yeah, let's go in, go to the second floor, close the doors. Um, capacity 14, 25 kilograms, 19 persons. Second floor, go back down to the ground floor. There's the view, there's the Manda House, the Manda Centre's over there. Where we've been to earlier. Doors closing. Doors and closing. That sounds like the Sainsbury's. That sounds like the Sainsbury's being bombed on their tunnel system. Ground floor. Ground floor. And that's it. Now we're heading to the main shopping centre, the Manda Centre. And we're heading to the main anchor store which is Fraser's, 
which used to be Debenhams, and Fraser's has a set of two Kone Monospace lifts. Okay then, uh, these are the lifts at the Fraser's department store at the Mandler Shopping Centre in Wolverhampton Sea Centre and, he's, and here they are and these are Cone Mono Spaces. This is incorporated with Sports Direct and Game. And, uh, oh. Coming down. Oh, it's this one. Here we are, here it is. Get a one. Uh, capacity, uh, 21 person, 1600 kilograms, built 2017 when the store was Debenhams. This was where Debenhams was. Oh. Here we are, first floor, go to the lower ground. And before this was TJ Hughes. But uh, the lift was a Cone M series in a different part of the store. Lower ground floor. Lower ground, go back down up to ground floor. Go back up to ground. Going up. Ground floor. Ground floor. And that's it. Now to the main right. lifts in the shopping the centre, which are cone mono spaces. Anyway, uh, these are the lifts at the Manda shopping centre in Wolverhampton city centre. And these are cone mono spaces. Capacity uh, 13 persons, 1,000 kilograms, built 2016. These are near Fraser's and HMV. Here we are, car park. Car park. Go back down to Lower Mall. Go down to Lower Mall. Throw them out. Go down the wrong out. Wait there a minute. Doors are now closing. These uh, lifts uh, replaced the central lifts that were Otis and they were glass lifts. And lower mile was square level, upper mile gallery, and car park was roof level. Lower mall. Here we are, lower mall. And that's it. Okay, now to the Stanner one. lift in Clark's. Okay, this is the lift at Clark's at the Manda Shopping Centre in Wolverhampton City Centre. And this, is, and this is a Stanner, but the nine plate has gone. And the capacity is 630 kilograms, eight persons. First floor. First floor. Go back down to ground. Except the floor numbering is incorrect. It should be one and Door two. opening. Because it's a non-existent floor. Door's closing. Go back down to the ground floor. Lift going down. Going back down now. Stanner. Ground floor. Ground floor. Door's closing. And that's it. This is the now to the former Wilco's, which had an Otis Gen 2 life lift. And this it's lift was decommissioned before it's Wilco's went into administration. This was where VHS was. They used to have old Otis's and then they installed this new Otis one. Well, go to the lower ground. Capacity 10, 20 kilograms, 13 persons, you built 2019. Nice display. This was a setting how Woolworths did used to do. Here we are, upper ground, back at UG. It's going to be these doors. Now along to the Rubax lift, which is outside Matalan. Now recently, this lift had been out of action, but however, I have filmed this lift multiple times. And uh, the floor numbering on this lift is very uh, interesting because the buttons is ground one and two, while the floor indicators are in letters S for square level, G for gallery level, and R for roof level. 
And uh, now uh, the voice says lower level, upper level and car park. Before it was square level, new look gallery level and roof level. The reason why it was saying new look gallery level, that's because Matalan used to be new look. But new look, but new look has now moved into a smaller unit within the centre on the lower level. And then Matalan took it over in 2019. It would have made sense for it to say Matalan gallery level. But they updated the announcements. So it would say lower level, upper level and roof level. And it might have also been sensed for ground floor, first floor and second floor. Or maybe floor zero, floor one, floor two. And anyway, let's crack on with this lift. So I've got footage of both the new and the old announcements. Here we go. Let's go to second floor. Close the doors. This is the other lift at the Manda Shopping Centre in Wolverhampton City Centre. This is a Rubax, capacity 10 persons, 800 kilograms. Going up to car park, second floor. She used to be roof level. Car park. Car park. Go to new look gallery level, now upper level on level one. Doors opening. Going down. Doors closing. Dewhurst fixtures. Going down. And then, oh. upper, level. upper level, formerly New Look Gallery level. Let's go back down to lower level, ground floor, which was square level. Okay. Even though that says ground level. Oh, hello. What are you yeah, that's all right. Someone with... Matalan at the Manda Shopping Centre in Wolverhampton. There was Nickel Man, Adam's Kids and Halloween House. This is a room back slit. Go on to the roof. Capacity 10 persons, 800 kilograms. Here we are at roof level. Go to New Look Gallery level, Matalan. Doors opening. Going down. Doors closing. Nice voice. Look in the mirror, do you see? Hi now. New Look Gallery. Here we are, New Look Gallery level, well, Matalan Gallery level. Doors opening. Go G. Oh, hello, going down. Yeah, go to the Just the elevator and the BTS. Doors closing. Ground, yeah, yeah. Here we go. Just like the lifts. You just don't like the lifts. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Square. Here we are, square level. And that's it. Now along to the lift in Waterstones, which is an old, antique, vintage Evans lift. Let's ride it. Okay then, uh, this is the lift at, Wolver at Waterstones in Wolverhampton City Centre, going to one. And uh, this is an Evans, capacity 450 kilograms, six persons, old gated lift. Here we are at one, go back down to ground. Wow, awesome motor. Here we are, ground, and that's it. And now we're going to one of my favourite buildings of all time in the centre of Wolverhampton, the awesome old Beatty's department store, which has sadly now closed down. That's because uh, House of Fraser, which acquired Beatty's during the 2000s, has moved into the Manda Centre uh, under the name of Fraser's. So anyway, here are the lifts which are filmed within BT's when it was open. Here is the glass lift.
Here is the car park lift and at the time of filming I was doing an urban exploring of this department store so if you want to watch that video click the link. And now to the old Otis lift. Now to the lift that goes into the restaurant area, Cafe Zest. And there is a similar lift to this one, but at the time of filming, that one was out of action. Now to the Tissencrop lift. Now along to m &S, which has a cone generic lift with Stentagate announcements. And uh, this store here used to be on three levels, but however, the second floor is now closed off. Okay, one. Doors closed. Okay then, uh, this is the lift at m &S in Wolverhampton City Centre. And this is a cone capacity, 26 persons, 2,000 kilograms speed is 0 0.0 meters per second. Uh, stand to gate voice. Level one. Uh, let's go. Here we are, level one. We're going to go back down to level zero. Doors open. Level two's closed. Going down. And level three staff. Doors closing. Staff only. Very nice. Uh, cone. Going down. There's the alarm bell and there's the open door. 
Level zero. Zero. You're not zero. And that's it. Doors. Now to the lift in River Island, which is a standard. Talk, lift. talk, talk, talk. Anyway, this is the lift at River Island in uh, Wolverhampton City Centre. And um, this is a Stanner lift. Uh, I think the capacity on this lift is 630 kilograms, eight persons, but it doesn't say. Here we are, one. This used to be, I think this used to be where the old gap was. Hence the stuff star, the lift here, we are the ground, first floor menswear, talk, 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 talk. And we're going back down and the lift is maintained by ice lift. Going back down. This is a Stanner. Back at zero, floor, and that's it. And now along to the former next door, which had a very nice, awesome, old Hammond and Champness lift. But however, this door closed ages ago, and now the lift is decommissioned. Go on. This is the lift at next in Wolverhampton. It's a Hammond and Champness lift, capacity seven persons, 525 kilograms. Got the Oakland lights. It's a very old lift. Here we are, one, go back to G. Nice motor, to be honest. Go back down to ground. Nice motor. Indicator don't work properly, floor indicator's almost burnt out. And here we are back at ground. And that's it. Now we're heading along Lidgefield Street and we are going to the art gallery, which has a very huge cone eco disc lift. Okay then, this is the lift at the Art Gallery in Wolverhampton City Centre. And these, this is a Cane Eco Disc, capacity 50 persons, 400 kilograms, built 2005. First floor. Go back down to exit. Wow! This lift is huge! Huge lift! And now to Wolverhampton train station, where there is Cotswold lifts, however one lift had been modernised. And we are also doing the station car park lift. Let's go to level 9. Okay then, this is the lift at Wolverhampton railway station car park. And this is a stunner. Capacity, the and the lift capacity is 16 persons and 1,200 kilograms. Level two. Oh, well, it's level three, so, because this has got odd numbers on. Not sure if there's an even lift. I don't think there is. Level nine. Back to level one. Doors opening, lift going down. Let's go to, that's level nine. Level nine. Level seven. Level, it's going down. Level one. Level one. Back at one. And that's it. Okay then, these are the lifts at Wolverhampton Railway Station. We're starting on platform number four first. Bridge. Doors closing. This lift is a Cotswold. 
Capacity 1250 kilograms, 17 persons, built in 2004. Gonna swap lifts at every time we reach the bridge. Overbridge level. Overbridge. Gonna send this down to platform and we'll swap to platform three and the platform three lift now. Two and three lift. Platform. Yet another Cotswold. Hello, you're going down to platform. Platform. This is platform two and three lift. The next lift we'll do is platform one. Is platform one and the additional platforms and way up. Very nice Cotswold lift, I have to say. Here we are over bridge. Yeah, the other bridge. Okay, finally we're going to uh, to the lift that goes to platform one and platforms five and six. Doors opening. This, this one's a stanner. Capacity, uh, 16 persons, 1200 kilograms. Doors closing. Built in 2004 as a Cotswold and then got modernised to stanner in 2021. Not sure, but I know it was modernised by stanner. Platform level. Platform level. Let's go back to bridge. Doors opening. Lift going up. Doors closing. Anything emergency alarm? Coming back up. Bridge level. And that's it. 